be stupid. Think it through. You I cannot give up. Yes, yes, move for it. Where's the answer? Where's the answer? Doctor Karlov. <coughs> Doctor Karlov. Doctor Karlov. I've got a bandage inside. I'll get one for you. I'm Natasha. I'm the new cleaner here. You are Dr. Kozlov. Yes, but I'm not that sort of doctor. I know, you are a physicist, a scientist with the government. That will keep it clean and it should heal quickly. But please, excuse me, I'm about to leave for work. Are you working on anything important right now? You are, aren't you? Yes. An experiment. A machine. I've been working on it for years. Are you nearly finished? Uh, uh, yes. You did not get caught in the rain. Your bandage looks dirty. Let me get you a clean dress. You have no photographs, no pictures, nothing of the past. I don't like photographs. Why? A photograph. <clears throat> It's a moment frozen in time. Time can't be held in an image. There's no truth in that. We should all concentrate on the present. Worse than your students, worse than the lazy ones, the ones you despise. You're like them now. Look at you, trying to find the things you thought you had. They're not even there. How incompetent. You shouldn't call yourself a scientist. You're a disgrace.
Nina, you have a daughter. This, this is your wife. You say you have no memories, no photographs. What is this machine that you are working on? You wouldn't understand. How could you? You're, you're just a cleaner. Dr. Kotlov, it is very urgent that I speak with you. Open the door. Let me get the door. They have to shut me down. Dr. Kotlov! I just... Kotlov! I don't know It is very urgent that I speak with you. Dr. Kozlov is very ill. His work made him sick. Can't tell what is real and what's not. But he is a threat to himself, and we have to take him away. Stop you. Not a fool you. I think you're as stupid as they are. Prove them wrong. <laughs> 